Hey everybody, welcome back. I am going out for the day. I've been to the gym this morning and now I am um, getting ready to just hit the town. I've been in the house working on my eBay business. I've been getting a lot of sales lately. Um, I have right now listed 138 items and I try and list every day because they say if you list in your store daily, you get sales. So pretty much I've been getting a sale just about every day, one to three sales a day and only have a little store. So I'm happy about that. Um, but I did get my workout on this morning and it felt great. I swam um, four laps, I walked four laps, and then I did my regular uh, aerob water aerobic exercises. I worked out for a total of 45 minutes and I um, relaxed my muscles in the jacuzzi for 15 minutes, then I showered and left. So I came home, I've had, fed the puppies, Bentley and Cooper um, took care of them and uh, let them out. And now I'm just gonna get out and uh, grab me a bite to eat. And I might do a little, I don't think I'm a thrift. I think I'm gonna wait and go tomorrow to Black Friday deal, see uh, what they have there down in Marietta. And um, I'll probably take you guys along with me. Uh, so that's what I might do. Just just um, go to Black Friday deals. Ooh, these cars is flying around this camp today. You wonder where all these cars coming from. This little road get busy sometime. The patience is a virtue. Ain't never in no hurry, honey. Take your time and to get where you want to be, safe and sound. Oh, yeah. So I um, I got what I did was I, how many people uh, shopped on Prime Day the last two days? Me, I shopped on Prime Day and I got uh, quite a few items. Matter of fact. Um, I'm going to show you guys one of the items I got. I got some glass, um, glass, uh, uh, prepping containers. Cause I had, I have the plastic prepping containers. I don't know where they at, um, with the, with the lids on them. Uh, I don't really care for them too much because whenever you heat them up, you know, like if you have something with red in it or whatever and the plastic gets scratched up and all that, you know, it worked for a while. But then uh, when I seen they had uh, the glass containers with the snap lids, I have the plastic ones with those same snap lids in my RV. But, um, and they're, they're single serve size, which makes it perfect for uh, when I meal prep, because I'm gonna start meal prepping. And um, those would be great for meal prepping. They're, they're called meal prepping containers. I was looking on eBay and other places, and for five, just five of the glass containers, they wanted $25, $30. Well, I got 15 for $33 yesterday. Yes, 15 for $33. So I was happy. That's a dollar and something a piece uh, about that. Cause I was like, only four or five for thirty dollars and twenty five dollars? Not me. I'm retired. I can't do that. <laughs> no, no, no. Um, gotta count these coins. Make sure they stretch. So yeah, today is a beautiful day here in Georgia. It's uh, in Douglasville anyway. It's uh, sunny and bright as you can see. And that just makes me want to get out and enjoy the day even more. Although I do need to, uh, I need to do some work, but it's early. It's just um, like, I think 1130 or something. So I'll probably start working in, the, in my eBay room about one or two uh, 
today. That's one good thing about being uh, retired or self-employed. You can, you know, work at your leisure. And that's what I do like. So, and I'm learning a lot as far as sales. I bought a lot of stuff that um, I shouldn't have bought to sell. And I bought a lot of good stuff to sell. And I may have to do a yard sale one day to get rid of the things that can't sell on eBay. They have out here in Douglasville, the police at the police station, they be doing um, yard sales where you can pay $25 for a booth. I think I'm gonna try and do that. I need to find out how that works, how often they have them. I'm probably gonna uh, go, you know what? That's what I can do after I eat. I can go by the Douglasville Police Station and see if they have um, a schedule for when they have those. And I can, uh, that give me a, a enough time because every time I see it, when they say, if you want a booth, it's always the day before <laughs> or the day of, and it's too late. So yeah, if I can get a booth, I would rather do that than have a yard sale in my house. But yeah. So, so yeah, that's what I think I'm going to do. I'm going to go by the police station and, and uh, see if they have a list of how many days and what days they do it so I can uh, prepare in advance for a yard sale. And I need to go through a lot. I still have some boxes in my garage. Plus, you've seen the boxes in my basement, in my eBay room. A lot of, I need to go through a lot of that stuff and get rid of um, some items. Like, I have some baking supplies in the, in the basement. Um, the little candy things and all that still, and I'm, I'm just gonna throw all that out because it's no good. So, I, hey, I might just let you guys uh, come with me while I clean that up. You know, if you want, you know, you can uh, sit with me and watch me as I uh, go through all these items in the house and get rid of stuff because um, we're gonna start back up our baking business um, out here as well but we're trying to do one thing at a time which is the eBay we're trying to get that off and running um, smoothly um, and then we're gonna transition we're gonna start um, the baking business as well so just one thing at a time and once you get one thing up and running smoothly then we're gonna uh, venture into uh, the baking business because as they say you always need at least three streams of income you really do uh, it's always good to have at least three streams of income something happened you always got something coming in and uh, that's that's what it's all about and I'm showing my family my son how to do it and he's a, he likes the way that I do uh, e eBay he was shocked at um, some of the profits and he be letting me know mom don't be getting down you got to think about you took 50 cents and turned it into $30 you took you know two dollars and turned it into $25 you know so um, don't get down because sometimes I'll be like it's not going good it's not I'm not making any really any money it's taking too long and he's everything takes time nothing this happens overnight you just got to be consistent and um, that's what I'm doing being consistent and not giving up just like I am with this weight loss journey I never gave up on my weight loss journey and I never would have thought I would have lost uh, 40 pounds in a long, long time. Now, yeah, once I lost 100 pounds when I was young, but uh, at the age I am now, no, I hadn't lost any any uh, significant amount of weight. That's the most significant amount of weight that I have lost in over a uh, good 20 years, and I'm happy about it. Well, guys, I'm going to let you go for now. Just want to chit-chat with you for a minute. Um, I'm going to go on and grab me. A, like I said, I'm on the way to get me a bite to eat. And um, then I'm going to go to the uh, 
police station and see about um, how this works with uh, see if they got a list for me to see the days that they have the uh, yard sales um, where we can have a booth all right talk to you later i'll probably take you guys along with me when i go to the well no they ain't gonna let me bring no camera in the police station all right bye for now Look at the new keys. Hey, where the rest of you guys? Hey, come on over. It's a whole lot. Come here. Don't see me on camera. I'm not. Come here, Gizmo. Look, Look at my friend's babies. <laughs> <laughs> hey, YouTube. Look, these are little toy poodles. Look at Yorkies. them. Yorkies. Look at all the Yorkies. This is my friend Londa's babies. And this is a new one. She's a new addition. And she's gonna Raquel, and she's gonna look like them. Look, hey, poo poo. Uh oh, he, Molly done jumped in. Molly, and look at that one. And look at that one. Yes, we have a house full of Yorkies, guys. And we got some for sale. And we got some for sale. So if somebody's looking for some Yorkies, and you're in the Douglasville, that Georgia area. Uh, let us know you can leave a comment down below and your information and we'll get in contact with you ain't they cute hey youtube belita's world looky say hi 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 guys they are so freaking cute look at them you better get them out of their yard before them pet bulls come one it's 10 of them guys it's 10 and it's well it's seven seven and three babies is for sale but she keeping all seven of the other ones she refused to let them go oh oh those are the twins they so cute and tiny and he's shivering oh him shivering okay here you go I gotta get on out of here because I want to get cute. home. He is so cute. I didn't put this you on camera. This I didn't. The, this the boy. Okay, I didn't put you on camera. Just him. Yeah. Hey, baby, say hi. Say so hi, cute. mama. I told you. All of them is cute. Look at that one down there on mama's leg. Hi, y'all. Well, That's say daddy. bye. Bye. Bye, YouTube. Okay, everybody. Well, I ended my day. I hope you enjoyed the little Yorkies. I didn't really vlog all day because my friend came over and she wasn't camera ready and um, we hung out and did some things and I shipped out some more orders that came through but this is Valida's world if this is your first time ever visiting me hit that thumbs up button hit the subscribe button and share my videos and if you're returning as always thank you thank you thank you so much for um, following me on youtube instagram and tiktok the leaders world and as always peace love and happiness is the only way to live check you guys out later